Okay, okay, uh, yeah, we are having issues. <laughs> We're having definite issues. Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to Faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we are checking out something really, really weird. So this is the Flet Fletner, Fletner FI-282. Uh, it was built by Rowan, and it looks insane, so, um, I thought we'd check it out. Also, just as a quick side note, as we start this video, um, if I sound a little bit weird, uh, it's because I can't hear myself in the left, in my left ear. I, I don't know what's going on. Um, so yeah, if I sound weird, that is the reason. Anyway, uh, we're gonna go ahead and get into this thing, and, uh, we're gonna fly it around, and then essentially what I wanna do is, um, rescue someone? If we can, I don't know if that's possible, uh, but something like that would be kind of cool. So, let's go ahead and get on with it, shall we? Alright, so, uh, I'm not entirely sure how we fly this thing. Um, I have literally no idea, but uh, we got a throttle lever right here, uh, and that is it. <laughs> that is it. Okay, so we're throttling up. I'm going to press 1. That should start our engine, which indeed it has. And then up should be uh, propeller pitch, I guess. And then we should essentially just take off, I think. Is that right? Is it ready to go? I think it's sort of ready to go. Please take off. <gasps> it's doing it. It's in the air. Dude, this is weird. So um, because we've got these propellers uh, in the position that they're in, uh, they're, that is insane. Um, we don't actually need a tail propeller, which is the reason these helicopters exist. Exist. exist, exist. Um, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and try and do a mission now. So let me figure one out and we'll go do it. We do actually already have a mission, which is deliver lighthouse equipment. Now, I do think that is just small things, so if we can get the small things and put them in this thing, uh, that would be pretty cool. Um, but yeah, I don't know if this is going to be difficult to fly or not. I have no idea. Okay, okay, uh, yeah, we are having issues. <laughs> We're having definite issues. Um, the propellers ended up smacking into each other, and now the propellers have died. So, um, that is a thing that's happened. I need a new one. Oh, I wanted to show you guys this as well. This is the way it spawns in. It does some flips and then it land. Oh, it did land on its front, uh, on its wheels before, but this time, this time it hasn't. Uh, we need a new one again. Also, just as a quick side note again, uh, you can't actually spawn this in here. It is too big. So this is a mission spawn. Okay, hopefully I've changed the way it spawns in. N -n 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 not really, not really at all. Okay, brilliant. Well... Um, so it's just on its side now. Okay, perfect. Exactly how I wanted it. Not at all. Uh, not at all how I wanted it. Okay, right. Can we just push it over? Is that a thing? No? It spawned in, like, all right the first time. It landed on its wheels. This time, no. All right, there we go. I've actually managed to get it spawned in properly now, um, which is good. Yeah, it is very nice. Uh, but again, we're gonna have the same problem that we had earlier, which is, of course, that the propellers might end up smacking into each other. And that is a definite, definite problem with this thing. However, we're going to go ahead and turn sideways anyway. And we're going to go ahead and collective up. Okay, this seemingly is fine so far. As long as we don't do weird aerobatics, it should be fine. I'm hoping it's going to be fine. So we're going to go up. I'm going to stop pushing up and we're just going to go forwards. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, very weird design and it shouldn't really work. But it does. So, um... Yeah, as long as they don't, like, crash into each other again, we should be fine. I'm not entirely sure why it happened last time either, so... Yeah. Oh, dude, this is weird. Hey, what a weird helicopter. Oh, I actually completely forgot about fuel. Um, we, we will run out of fuel. <laughs> um, oh, we've actually just exploded! What in the world?! Oh, God, we're going down. We are going down. Mayday! Mayday! Oh, boy. Alright, I'm gonna just try and... Uh-oh. We've lost a blade on the left side. We've lost a blade on the right side. We're going down. We died. We died again. Okay, we haven't quite died ourselves, though, so we should be able to get out and swim away. Okay, well, that's a bit of a de death trap. Um, yeah, I mean, it's an interesting idea, though, so we're going to get another helicopter, and we're going to try and do the same mission, because why not? Okay, so this is a completely different helicopter, and, of course, it is it's going to have issues. Uh, it is going to have a few issues. Um, so, we can't actually use the thing that it's meant to be used for, <laughs> which is carrying, uh, big things, very big things, uh, using electrical connectors, which we don't really have. 
Um, and we don't have any on the boxes that we will be transporting. But I figured this was a cool aeroplane to actually try out. Or helicopter, I should say. Uh, it's got twin rotors, again, like the other one. And, um, yeah. I don't know. It's just interesting. So it's a sky crane. It looks Russian. And, um, yeah, we'll go ahead and get inside. And we'll try it out. It is worth noting that the front part of this actually literally just looks like a plane. Um, so if we get upstairs, we've actually got some passenger bits. And if we get in the front in the pilot seat, you can see. The front bit just looks like a plane. Uh, with with a bit taken out of it. So anyway, uh, we're gonna try and turn it on and get into the sky um, And then we'll see what happens from there. So nav lights. Uh, I've turned the wheel brakes off. That's fine. Hopefully um, Usually the stuff is on the roof, but there is no study things on the roof. So There you go. How do I turn this thing on? I don't know. What is this? Low altitude warning. Yeah, we're on the ground, dude. Uh, engine, yes, hard starter, there we go, everything is on, literally just two buttons, and then we should be able to take off, yeah, oh dude, that's easy, look at where the engines are, <laughs> that's amazing, that's actually really cool, uh, so we should, in theory, be able to do this mission anyway, uh, because we do have loads of room, but yeah, so it flies completely fine, it has some sort of weird autopilot thing, which, uh, Allows it to just be really stable. So if I stop pressing W now, it should go to like, yep, there we go. It stops itself midair and it'll stay like this. So it has its own little gyro system. That's cool. That's very cool. Um, but yeah, I need to try and make sure that we can get the boxes in here. I don't think I'll be able to land at the uh, at the lighthouse itself. So this is going to be interesting. I think we're going to have to chuck the parcels out, which is definitely a really weird way of doing things. But that might be what we're going to have to do. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and land here. This is the Starter Island, of course, as you guys probably already know if you're watching this video. Um, so yeah, we're going to go down, we're going to try and pull it backwards, and we're going to load everything in. Hopefully, this is going to go fine. I'm assuming it will. Uh, although, whoa! Okay, that was weird. That was very strange. It might accidentally take off again by itself. I need those brakes. There we go, good. Um... Can we turn it off? Is that okay? Oh, action! I can actually decrease engine RPS. That's smart. That is very smart. Lights? Yep. What is this? Whoa, wait, there's a... Oh, there's a way to get out on the roof. Interesting. Right, anyway, uh, we need to see if we can fit this through the door. If we can't fit this through the door, there is a way of doing it. Uh, which is going to be difficult, but we'll see. Here we go. Lift it up and slot it. Oh, it's far too big for the door. It is too big for the door. Okay, right. We've got a way of doing this. It's fine. Don't worry. Everybody, it's okay. Whoa, how do I use this back here? I have no idea. Uh, right. ISO, ISO, ISO. Okay. Unlift. Wait, unlift? Can we make the whole thing go down? That is what I want. Um... Okay, go down. No, I want the entire thing to go down. Main winch up, main winch down. No, okay. Uh, we can make them go up and down separately. Oh, okay. So I thought it was a big cradle. Um, when I say that, I mean I thought this blue thing would come down. Uh, but I don't think this blue thing does actually come down. So that means we can't actually take this anywhere. Yeah, not really. Unless we just chuck it up there and hope for the best. Yep. Well, we can definitely take these ones. So let's go ahead and put these in. Okay. All right, come on. Please go inside. There we go. There's one. Let's go ahead and get another one. Here we go. Yes. Okay, put that inside as well, please. Thank you. Good. And then get inside, go upstairs. And we'll try and get the thing off. What is going on in there? What in the world? That looks weird. That looks mental. Uh, right, okay, go upstairs, under the roof. Yes. Grab the box and try and put it somewhere safer. Uh, I don't know where's safer. Okay. Um, <laughs> well, I guess, I guess we'll just leave that replacement motor over there. Uh, and we'll deliver these two smaller pieces. I think that's fine, right? They'll be okay with some of the delivery, I'm sure. Alright, so let's go ahead and get into the sky again. Let's turn this RPS up to 12, I think. Yes. And we should be able to just go. 
Yep, alright, we're in the air. Uh, the controls are uh, seemingly a little bit weird, but actually in the same time completely fine. So roll is actually on left and right instead of A and D. That's the only issue that I've got. Um, but it actually seems to fly completely fine, so that doesn't matter too much. Awesome. I've also got cruise mode on the side. Now, I'm not entirely sure what that does. I have no idea what that does. Uh, we've also got increased pitch limit. There we go. Look at that. We've got decreased pitch limit, so that's actually pretty interesting. We should be able to go a little bit faster now. That's cool. Look at this thing in first person, too. Yeah. We have alt... Wait. Alt hold. Where is that? Oh! Here we go. Look at this. So you can actually change it. That's smart. That's really smart. Nice. So you can choose between the control modes. That is actually really smart. Um, but yeah, nav lights are on. Spotlights, we actually have some. And we got a cabin light as well in case we need it. I'm going to equip a parachute because I probably will jump out of this thing eventually. And um, yeah, so actually, I really like it. Right, we're pretty much almost there, so uh, we are doing just fan, just fan. Okay, reset altitude hold. What does that actually do? I don't know what that actually does. Um, but we can have splitted uh, roll plus yaw, or we can have combined roll plus yaw, uh, which is good for helicopters. You know, having the difference between those, that's quite smart. That's very smart. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and go down. There is no way I'll be able to land anywhere near that, so we're going to have to chuck the parcels out. Which seems like a bad idea to me, but um, at the same time, might be fine. Maybe. Okay, so I'm going to hope for the best here. We're going to go ahead and turn ourselves to the right uh, just slightly. Yes. Okay, to the right a bit more. And we're going to hopefully just stay level. Oh, boy. Okay, it's not really working. Not really working the way I want it to. Okay, can we just stay here, please? Okay. It seems to want to go to the left, but that's fine. Uh, go downstairs, open the door. Uh, okay, maybe it's this door. No, we have turned around. Okay, let me spin. Let me spin real quick. Uh, that'll do, that'll do. All right, jump downstairs. Run, 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 run. Come up. Uh, grab up a parcel. Oh, boy. Okay, run backwards. Push it out the door and throw it that way. <gasps> I just dropped it. Okay, I didn't throw it at all. I need to throw them. Okay, throw it. Too far. All right, well, uh, we're giving up on that mission. <laughs> that mission is fine. We're going to go back upstairs. Uh, we're going to get in our little seat. And we're going to rescue this dude down here on our left. There is a dude on the, on the rocks. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, we got issues. I just smacked into the floor. Did that break anything? I don't think it did. This is actually starting to be hard to control for some reason. I'm not sure what's happened here, but but something's happened. Oh boy. Okay, right. Everything is fine. Don't worry. The stable flight part of this thing just seems to have stopped working. Anyway, go down. Yep. Okay. Okay. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. It's drifting. It, it keeps drifting to the left. I'm not sure why. In fact, I have no idea why. I, also, it's going up. That's really weird. I don't know how to control it. Ground mode? Whoa! <laughs> Cruise mode? No. No, 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 no. No. What is going on? Okay, we're good. I think we're fine. <laughs> I think we're fine. All right, we're definitely not fine. Reset altitude like here. Uh, no. E no. Okay, doesn't work. Doesn't matter. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, Google is now talking to me. Okay, I've got a way of fixing this. Shut up, Google. I've got a way of fixing this. Here we go. All right, we just land next to him. Like this. Yes. I'm going to count that as landing. Okay, we've landed. We go up here. Yes. We jump out the door. Uh-huh. And then we go get him. Okay, fantastic. Oh, it's breaking. Oh, it is definitely breaking. Okay, now we just jump back in. Uh. 
Wait, wait, jump. Oh my god. Okay, right. Wait, wait, ow. We're fine. We are. Okay, we're not fine. I died. Okay, well, anyway, um, I'm gonna leave that there. If you guys want to check out either of the, uh, either of the creations in this video, I'll link them both down below. And, um, yeah, hopefully you guys have more fun with them than, uh, than that. I don't know. I, yeah. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.